This is harder, because I haven't told you this before. You have to want to show your phone today. Jennifer says roads and houses. Remember we did the cause and effect activity? Pavement. Remember when we have pavement, what happens? When a lot of the roads are paved and you have lots of concrete, what does that what does that do? What does that cause? How does that impact aquifers? Alexis? It prevents water from coming to us and specifically, can you add on to that for me? Yeah, it prevents water from going into the aquifers. Excellent. So definitely drought, we've got the issue of pavement, preventing water from getting soaked in. Because you know that asphalt, water can't soak through that. It only can soak through dirt and loose rocks. So that's preventing it from being refilled. And overall, we can just say the word consumption. Because what do people use water for? What do we use water for? To, to drink and what else? We use it to, yeah, we, have, we use it to make our food because animals, right? Animals, we use it for energy. And last one starts with N. Farming, yeah. So because of drought, pavement preventing water from being absorbed, and overall consumption, because they're just using water way too much, that's how we were able to reason through our argument, connecting our claim with our evidence. So now what you guys are going to do is write your own seat.